Hello everybody, I'm just coming on today to share some happy mail and Christmas cards that I've received over the last few uh, weeks really. Um, I'm sorry I haven't shown them before but I am still recovering from this fractured ankle and um, trying to hop around is so tiring that it's taken a lot out of me and also now my right hip is the muscles are really screaming so the doctor's given me codeine to try and help the pain and that just knocks me for six so I've spent a lot of time sleeping or not just feeling up to doing very much but anyway I thought today's the day I must come on and share these things with you so the first thing is this lovely Christmas card that I received yesterday or the day before from the lovely Wendy Love and it's absolutely beautiful card as you can see there and um, inside she says to Christine and family Merry Christmas my lovelies wishing you peace and happiness at Christmas Happy New Year have a lovely Christmas hugs Wendy loves crafting and family so thank you very much Wendy for that it's a beautiful card and I really appreciate that then um, much longer ago, I received this envelope from the lovely Pip Saucer Fields. So this is the card that she sent me, which says Merry Christmas. And as you see, there's a flying saucer here. I'm sure that has something to do with, with her YouTube name. <laughs> and uh, inside she says to Christine, Seasons Greetings. I'm wishing you a healthy, crafty 2020 with love, Pip Saucer Field. So that's very kind of you, Pip. Thank you very much. Uh, as I said in my last video, um, really, I'm not up to um, sending out cards at the moment. I've only just managed to send out my cards to my family and, and a few friends. So I'm very behind, but I'm hopefully in the new year, I shall make up for it. Now, also in this envelope was this little packet which um, unfortunately has come apart, but that's no problem because I can glue it back. So it is a brooch and it's a lovely Christmas brooch which Pip has made. So it's on a piece of wood, a little piece of, of wood. And uh, there you can see a Scottish bow, this deer. Here there's a tree hiding in the background and... Um, and then there's some, oh, uh, yeah, some, um, looks like mesh, textured mesh, which has been silvered. So that's really pretty. So I shall be mending that pip and wearing it on Christmas Day. Thank you very much for that. And then um, I got this card in the post from the lovely Alice Walker. It's just a beautiful card. It says Merry Christmas on the front. And it says to Christine, best wishes for a happy and healthy Christmas and 2020. Oh, no, sorry. Wrong person. <laughs> sorry. This is from the lovely Woolly Steph, who also sent me um, a beautiful, a beautiful um, pocket letter. So I wasn't really expecting anything. It came wrapped in this gorgeous green tissue paper. And let's see if I can show you the um the pocket letter so the, the images on the front are beautiful so there's this one all very vintagey the bells the christmas angel father christmas and a, and a couple of little girls another angel seasons greetings to you and your family from woolly steph beautiful another christmas angel Beautiful holly, two little kids, <laughs> their presents, and a beautiful Christmas decoration. And down the side is this washi tape, which is green with gold feathers. And if I turn it over, just show you briefly what's in the back. So the, the back of the paper has this gorgeous uh, green uh, holly and mistletoe. And so you can see there's a couple of gold coins there, which will be very much appreciated. Um, some wooden snowflakes 
and here we have some um, some more Christmas embellishments with um, snowflakes and a mitten and then here um, some berries and a leaf here I've got a lovely holly um, embellishment and a glittered Christmas tree it says Merry Christmas here are some beautiful wooden stars and here are some more Christmas trees and two beautiful snow globe shakers here if we can get it to focus there's a, a penguin and this one is two bells with some holly so they're beautiful and then finally some lovely ribbon so thank you um steph for all these lovely things it came as a complete surprise and you've really spoilt me i'm very grateful and uh, once again i want to thank you for all the support that you showed me while i was in hospital um, that was so much appreciated okay so the next thing i received is this lovely card and this is from um, Alice Walker, Handmade with Love by Alice Walker. It's a lovely stamp that you have, Alice. Beautiful. So this lovely card, which is especially for you with love, and it's got these three beautiful gems at the top, and this gorgeous topper. And inside it says to Christine and family, have a wonderful Christmas and Happy New Year. Love, Alice. And the, the sentiment in the middle says, Christmas tree is sparkling stockings full of gifts mistletoe is hung around for that christmas kiss we wish you a merry christmas may it be full of christmas cheer may the happiness of the season continue through the new year so that is is lovely thank you alice and i mean i think christmas is such a special time and it is so important that we realize you know the true value of christmas really you know that as we know it's not just having um, lots to eat or enjoying things that we don't normally have but it is also a time of peace and joy and of um, being with the family and spreading that peace and joy around us and it's not something just for christmas is it you know it's something for for all time you know it's something that should, we should be trying to do all the time um so i hope you all have a very happy and peaceful christmas but before i go i just want to share with you one last thing um amy manley was doing a giveaway on her channel she had won this um oops, this uh pack crafty little kids pack in a raffle and in fact, she had won two of them. So she decided that she was going to give one away. And my name was called, pulled out of the hat. So um, it arrived with um, this beautiful Christmassy paper, another Christmas on it. So Christine, congratulations on winning my giveaway from Amy. And inside the packet, as well as the plastic wallet was also this little uh, pack of Christmas embellishments. I put it up the wrong way around. So some beautiful die-cut holly leaves um, um, decorated with red, um, red gems to make the berries. So they're just beautiful. Thank you, Amy, for those. So this is what was in the pack. So there are some cards and envelopes. There are some pipe cleaners in bright colours there. There are some foam feathers in red, green and yellow. Some wiggly eyes. In fact, there are two packets of wiggly eyes. There are some foam squares in orange, purple, yellow and red or and green. There are some stars in various colours, some pom-poms in a variety of colours, and a stick of glue to, to use to make the projects. And um, so that's it. This is um, uh, 
this is the kit and the challenge is to make something with these things and to to load it up to, to show Amy what I've done with it. Um, I have to say that at the moment as the brain's a bit fuzzy I haven't been very inspired but I'm sure I will be as time goes by and uh, but if any of you have any ideas um, I would be grateful you know just to know what you would do with them so um, particularly the foam feathers and the pipe cleaners and pom-poms because these really are outside my comfort zone and um, yeah, I'm, and I'm up for a challenge, so I'd quite like to see what I could do with them. But as I say, if anyone's got any suggestions, um, I'd be grateful to receive them if you could just jot them down in the um, comments section below. So that's it for now. Thank you all for watching. And as I said before, have a lovely Christmas. Bye for now.